Dublin, you know, it, it was just really poor out of sorts performance that I wasn't expecting with just 16 points. But I came around to thinking afterwards, like, is, it, is there something here where we've been talking about Dublin having more hurlers in the team, the likes of Connor Burke and, and Donald Burke and Ronan Hayes and really good lads and they're all well able to compete. But it, it's the point that in the past, when Dublin were considered this big physical team, sort of a lot of gym bunnies in there, this, this is how it would have been said. I would have never regarded them, uh, you know, in that way. But that they're not quite as, you know, physical as they might have been in before. So therefore, Parnell Park, the tighter confines, mightn't actually suit them the way it would have in the past. Yeah, maybe they're more kind of ball players now, maybe. And the, the way they play with a lot of sharp passing, and they, they overdid it the other night. And I thought some of the passing was a bit over, over the top. They weren't necessarily even giving the ball to a man in, in a better position at times. But I probably agree with you. Um, Kilkenny are always going to be physical. That's just the nature of them. And they're probably they're gonna they would out muscle a lot of teams on a given day, but they were definitely able to out muscle uh Dublin the other night and they were able to kind of they didn't really give them much space to operate in. Parnell is is you know significantly tighter than, than most grounds in the country, particularly uh Parky Cueve, Crow Park and Semple Stadium. And you know, I wouldn't yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't say that it suits Dublin the way they're playing now and the type of player that they have. Another thing as well, I, I couldn't get over how like Donald Burke to me is an absolute killer up front and he was just way too far back to pitch for me 